take a little look at that one. They had something just before we got to that part of the end game. Yeah, I mean, look at this. There's yeah, there's advantaged from here. Yeah, yeah. So we've got the pawn. So the up. So in essence, I mean, that's a that's plus three point five. So really, they should have done some damage to us. I did think this as well. But jump straight onto the well it don't matter if you've got a lot of pieces you've got to have your pieces working together look at that plus six Ooh. Hey, 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 hey. they must have made some major errors so we defended the pawn they attacked we take the queen off I think it's round about here where they may have made an error. Although it's it did drop quite significantly from there. So it's basically saying not going for the queen exchange. The computer doesn't like doing for going for queen exchanges. Yeah. Fair dues. Oh Looks like the only human, so that's fine. So capture, capture. They're still winning. It's plus one, and now it's a draw. We're we're just looking to exchange off if we can to try and improve the position. So from this point, felt like it was a little bit more equal. Um, yeah, okay. So just solidifying in my brain that at least um, that position that they had prior, I did have in my own mental roller decks, but we weren't really advantageous. It was more the opponent. And for just a little bit of fancy jostling here, we could probably maybe get an advantage. It does have these split pawns here, but if they're being clever, maybe they might might be able to support with the king but then they're taking themselves away from these pawns here I'm not too sure if the bishop should have really stayed here either but so we're bringing the knight across obviously looking for this juicy square see whether we can get rid of the troublesome bishop so it gives us the opportunity to do that so we can take it off the board so it's now more in our favor now because of the split pawns King's going to have to work really hard to support these pawns. <clears throat> so, so we elevate the king up. Woohoo, steady on, steady on. Alright, so yeah, it dropped to like a draw from that pawn move. I think I did actually tut when I did that move. <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah, I was concerned about him maybe pushing, but uh, maybe I shouldn't have been too concerned because he's still going to have to move his king down. So it's saying c5 just to get these pawns advanced up. Hmm. Right, doesn't like that pawn move. Got to rethink that. c5, so just leave them pawns alone. What was I fearing? I did this. Because if you drop this pawn or if you drop this pawn, but in essence, I suppose this king could just drop here, couldn't it? So if it did drop there, we'd be waiting to take this pawn off. So we'll just leave them hanging like that and probably start moseying these pawns up. That was a general idea. C5 or whatever, same C5, isn't it? Could even go for that. That's probably going to be wrong, isn't it? Uh, not really. Yes, yeah, so it's not really going anywhere. If he take, pushes down, pawn takes. If he pushes down, pawn takes. The king's going to be moving away. So there's not a right lot for them to do, really. Those are all negatives. So it's saying B3. 
So I don't think there's too much. But it's saying draw. If the opponent played it correctly, then it would end up being a draw. So we, we have to pay attention to that really. So if I was in this situation again, don't worry about these. Don't worry about these because at the end of the day, we're looking to block off these pawns. King's ready to go ramping over here. Maybe speed it up a bit. I mean, if he drops here, what happens? And if we go here, is it liking that? No, if we go here, and then we go here, and then they go here just to kill some time. So then it's our go. Now we can go here, looking to stop the king from coming here. What's he got? I mean, no, he's not. He's not going to want to do any of that. He's probably going to move backwards. So that gives us scope to go here, stopping it from coming here. And what does he do? He can't go anywhere. Excellent. Okay, that was a good lesson.